Hi, my name is Sean. I'm a second year student at Gutman Community College and my research advisor is Dr. Dalvin Hill and the topic is vaccine. The importance of incorporating vaccine records into health information exchanges. Research was conducted in the following areas, electronic health records, health information exchanges, vaccination record keeping, and vaccines, history, benefits, and record keeping. Current state of vaccine record keeping, paper-based, handwritten, ill-eligible, easily lost, damaged, misplaced, unreadable, challenging to verify authenticity and integrity of document. Proposal, store vaccine data in electronic format similar to the health records, reduces the fading of ink, possibility of ineligibility, et cetera. Records can be accessed from any device connected to the internet will require login by the patient and slash or healthcare provider and records are more accurate and harder to be tampered with. An electronic health record is a digital version of a patient's paper chart. Health information exchanges allow doctors, nurses, pharmacists, other healthcare providers and patients to appropriately access and securely share a patient's vital medical information. Records are stored electronically, improving the speed, quality, safety, and cost of patient care. Medical providers are able to write to a patient's record. While integrating medical records into electronic health records make it easy for people to view their medical records, there are risk of storing your data securely. People are concerned about their medical records being kept confidential and secure from being hacked or stolen. There are steps that can be taken to help keep people's health records secure and safe when accessing their medical records electronically. Patients have the autonomy to share records with anyone they see fit and they can revoke access anytime. The history of the vaccines provide numerous benefits to humans. Vaccines provide long-term, if not, lifelong protection against diseases like COVID-19, for example. The vaccines protect people, especially children, against severe diseases such as measles, smallpox, etc. When enough people get the vaccine against a given disease, the chances of an outbreak will be less likely to happen. Hard to, to read handwriting. Patients may lose their records and it is hard to recover and the ink may fade. Healthcare providers will make an entry into their computer systems once a vaccine is administered. The entry will be similar to notes entered during a medical appointment. This electronic record will be uploaded to the HIE so that patient slash medical provider can share with any participating medical provider throughout the USA removes the tediousness of reading handwritten records. There will be no more handwritten entries. It will be all done electronically and easier to access, update, and share records. Currently, there are some patients and healthcare providers that use electronic health records to ensure that immunization records are accurate and complete. If, for any reason, people's vaccination records are missing and slash or incomplete, the EMR system will alert the healthcare provider. Since EHRs are stored in electronically in one centralized location, EHRs can be accessed by both the patients and physicians. EHRs can do more than just storing vaccine information. There are a lot of pharmacists and healthcare providers have leveraged the capabilities of EHRs to improve vaccination rates among their patients. Pharmacists can enhance the EHR as a tool to improve vaccination rates for their patients. If records are stored electronically, only medical providers will have the autonomy of adding vaccination data once a vaccine is administered, thus increasing the authenticity and integrity of the record. The benefits of storing vaccination records in electronic format is one doesn't have to worry about the ink fading on the card. Another benefit of storing vaccination records in electronic format is one doesn't have to worry about losing their physical vaccine card. Thank you for listening.